We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies. In this clip, I'll cover actor Hal Linden. So he's probably best known for the television series Barney Miller. And this ran between 1975 and 1982 on ABC. And uh, this was heavily uh, reran in the 1980s. This is a comedy sitcom and was set in a New York City police station uh, in Greenwich Village. So I took a look at Hal Linden. And I believe that he resembles actor William Smith and possibly Lynn Lesser. So these two, they appeared together in a 1966 episode of the Western uh, TV series Laredo. Uh, the title of the episode was A Very Small Assignment. Also in this was actor Philip Carey. He was in The Time Travelers uh, from 1964. Lynn Lesser was also in Blood and Lace in 1971 with Gloria Graham and uh, Vic Tyback. Uh, Dennis Christopher was in this also. William Smith was in Any Which Way You Can with actor Clint Eastwood. Okay, so connections. Hal Linden appeared with William Smith on a 1977 episode of the Hollywood Squares uh, game show. And this was uh, dated uh, March 28th. And Hal Lennon also has a connection to Lynn Lesser. This was through the 1960 film Bells Are Ringing, starring Judy Holliday, Dean Martin, Fred Clark. There were a lot of uncredited actors in this movie. One of them was uh, Lynn Lesser. Frank Gorshin was in this. Uh, he was the Riddler in the 1960s Batman TV series. So bells are ringing. This is Hal Linden's movie debut. Yeah, and apparently he had some uh, training uh, as a stage actor. And apparently there's a version of uh, the production number in which uh, Hal Linden sings. It's called The Midas Touch. This is shown in the background of uh, the film print. But yes, yeah, it's, it's available as an extra on the DVD from Warner Home Video. He hasn't mentioned Lynn Lester, he's uncredited here, but he is a stranger uh, that appears at a crosswalk. So I run a YouTube channel, it's called Easter Egg Psychic, and there I go back and look at movies and television from the past. I analyze these for possible references to future media. Many such references appear, uh, they can take the form of anecdotes, idioms, anagrams, hidden in the subtext of the work in question. Also use an unconventional method where I try to match up the likenesses of the actors. And sometimes you can connect this to the anecdotal items and you find out something about the past and future roles uh, of the actors who may resemble the actor in the movie that you're watching. So I accept donations. Uh, you can send me Bitcoin. Uh, this is my Bitcoin wallet. And uh, if you know how to use Bitcoin, you just scan this and you can send me uh, whatever amount you choose. Contributions are greatly appreciated. And you can contact me at my email address. It's eggguy at yahoo.com, YouTube channel, Easter Egg Psychic. Thanks for watching.